if you want to get the whole Star Wars saga, you could look inside the Star Wars, the ultimate pop-up galaxy, my latest book, um, and you could you know, take the journey of the Skywalkers um, throughout the different generations, from Anakin to Luke and Leia, and so let's go to spread two and see where we're at on this epic journey. Whoa, would you look at that? It's the Death Star. There's all kinds of really cool little pull tabs on top of this that reveal scenes inside the Death Star and also activate the Death Star laser. Commence firing and then, you know, you know, it's all going on inside and then, then on this side you can see, I recognized your foul stench when I came aboard. We love our Carrie Fisher, don't we? Here's R2-D2 and C-3PO communicating with Luke. Right below it, you can see one TIE fighter in particular is trying to go after Luke. That's Darth Vader's TIE advance. Not only do we have this big main pop in the center, but we also have four other Star Wars destinations along the journey that Luke takes to become a Jedi. This pop-up is that battle that happened on Scarif. You can see three scenes inside the main tower where Jin and her, her allies are trying to get those Death Star plans. If you pull this little tab here, you can see an X-Wing fighter flying off and trying to blow up this ad at the Moss Eisley Cantina, a wretched hive of scum and villainy. You can see these sand troopers they're checking things out. And they're looking for some droids. I wonder where they are. Well, if we pull this tab over here, maybe we'll see. Oh, there they are. And you can see Hondo Baba loses an arm, but he deserved it. He's kind of a jerk. From every angle, you can get peeks from behind and see all the different characters. How would we get out of Maz Eisley? Well, we need, we need a certain Corellian smuggler and his uh, Wookiee first mate. Chewbacca, and um, it's Han Solo, and it is the Millennium Falcon. Now, she's looking really sleek and beautiful, and then we pull the tab, and it looks like the old Millennium Falcon that we all know and love, and you know, she made the Kessel Run in less than 12 parsecs. The last pop-up is the, the Rebellion's last stand on Yavin 4. This is the Rebel Alliance headquarters on Yavin 4. You can actually see where they're preparing to, to go attack the Death Star, so they're looking over the Death Star plans. You can pull a tab, and you can send off a squadron of X-Wings. There is one little extra Easter egg here, the ghost from Star Wars Rebels, which is a fantastic show. Thanks Star Wars fans for checking out this second spread from Star Wars, the ultimate pop-up galaxy. If you want to see more, go to insideditions.com.